Wolf and the Truth is catching part three with some more Undertale, and uh, today I'm gonna find out how to get past it. Stab look. God damn it, that's the first time I died. Oh, God damn it.
Let's see what we have to do. Oh. So now I'm guessing I have to look for which room it is. I'm guessing it's this one. Oh, shit. Didn't said that. Save motherfucking game. Do you smell? Do you smell? It? <laughs> oh, it was me. Ugh. 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 Surprise! It is a butterscotch cinnamon pie. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I'm gonna live here forever. So I will hold off on snail pie for tonight. What? It, she's not French, so I don't think she'll like that. Oops. Uh, here, I have another surprise for you. What's this surprise? Uh, can I? I'm gonna venture your house a little. Oh, I like this house. That fire is beautiful. Oh, pie. What a nice smell. Too hot to eat, though. Oh, I guess it's cooling down. Wait, maybe that's the snail pie. Maybe that's not the good pie that she made for me. This is it. I have a room of your own. 
and I hope you like it. Oh, I like that sheet pad sitting in my head. Is something burning out? Make yourself at home. Oh my god. Look at these cool toys. They don't interest you at all. Oh. It's in there. No, nothing. An empty photo frame is really dusty. Box of kids' shoes in disparity of size. I don't wear shoes. That's just my normal skin color. Oh, shoot. Um, maybe because I am going to leave the room, I should probably turn off the lights. Check out the rest of the house. This It's Toriel's Diary. Read the circle passage. You read the passage. Why did the skeleton warn a friend? Because she was feeling bonely. Ah, I love that one. Ah, <laughs> that's nice. Oh, I want a book like that. And it's the author is Toriel with the last name, like Toriel Toriel, like Mario's last name is Mario Mario, you know, you know what I mean, imagine his middle name was Mario and Luigi's was like Luigi Luigi Mario, and then it would be Mario Mario Mario, room under renovations, is somebody else coming, I'm gonna have some coke, ah, uh, Pepsi is good too. I don't really have a favorite. Actually, I don't know if Pepsi tastes good. I haven't had it in a while. I'm out of here. I'm not gonna go in her dungeon. Ah, she'll never know. Unless she has cameras. She'll never know. <gasps> Toriel! I think you should play upstairs instead. No! Oh, she's hiding something. She has child slaves down there. What you reading, Mom? Hello there, little one. The pie has not cooled down yet. Perhaps you should take a nap. Yes. Sweet dreams. Oh, oh, oh. I thought she wanted me to take a nap. Yeah, I wish I could take a nap while she's reading. I found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. Ah, uh, how do I eat it? No, see. Enter. Use. You ate the butterscotch pie, your HP was maxed out. Mom, are you there? Hello, mommy, mom, mommykins. You're still reading? Up already, I see. Um, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. And it, the sprite has glasses on too. There are so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've, always, I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I have always wanted to be a teacher. See those glasses in your looks? Ah, eh, you look good as a teacher. You can look like a pretty well, teacher or whatever I'm trying to say. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still, I am glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? When can... Uh... I go home. What is this? This is your home now. Um, would you like to hear about this book I am reading? It is called 72 Uses for Snails. Ooh. How about it? How do you exit the ruins? No, I'm sure. Here's an exciting snail fact. Did you know that snails make terrible shoelaces? Wow, that's funny, huh? Interesting. Yeah, well, bother me if you need anything else. I have to do something. Stay here. Okay, I'll stay here. Seems like the right size for Toriel. Can I sit in your chair? I want to sit in one of your chairs. It's a history book. Here's a random page trapped between and behind the barrier and feel fearful of further human attacks. We were Far, far into the earth we walked until we reached the caverns, and this was our new home, which we named. Home. <laughs> Not funny. As great as our king is, he is pretty lousy, and <laughs> I can see that. Can the ends of the tools have been filled down and filed down to make them safer? The fire isn't burning hot, just pleasantly warm. You could 
put your hand inside. Put your hand inside then. S then see what will happen. I have a feeling she'll find me down there. Where I'll find her down there. You wish to know how to return home? Do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I'm going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. No! No! I want to get back! I'm not going to be a good child. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come. They leave. They die. You naive child, if you leave the ruins, they, Escor, will kill you. I'm only protecting you. Do, do you understand? Go to your room. Okay, I guess I'll go to my rooms. I don't want to end this really quick. She better destroy it, because if she doesn't, I'm totally going to go in there and just sacrifice my life. Life is there's so many questions unanswered. Please don't spoil it. Spoil it for me, or else I'll probably cry. Just because you spoiled it. <gasps> no, I'm supposed to go down there. Oh my God, I have a feeling that I'm gonna meet some people that are um important to the story. Oh, maybe I have to save her. Maybe she's going too far and won't be able to destroy it. Oh, don't do not try and to stop me. This is your final warning. Oh please, she's gonna kill me, isn't she? You want to leave so badly? <laughs> you are just like the others. There is only one solution to this: prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Is that supposed to be this fast? 
I hope this isn't too fast. I'm gonna get to the next save point, then I'm gonna stop. Oh, no. Hee hee hee! I hope you like your choice. After all, it's not as if you can go back and change fate. In this world, it's kill or be killed. That old hag that should that she could bring she tried so hard to save you humans, but when it came down to it, hey hey, she couldn't even save herself. What an idiot! I want to walk around the stupid flower. Hopefully, I don't die. What happened? What? Please don't tell me it ended. It definitely did not end. It couldn't have ended. Bring me to the next save, please. Okay. That was weird. And it still is. I'm expecting a jump scare. Oh my god. Ah! Okay. My headset is now half off. Half off. I put down my volume before I started playing this as well. Oh my god, I know who that is! I'm in the community of this on Google+. Human, don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. Shake his hand, he's a nice guy. He's gonna joy buzz you! <laughs> Farts are always <laughs> The old whoopee cushion in the hand. It's always funny. I love this guy. I've heard so much about him. Anyways, here's the thing. That's hilarious. I'm sans. Yeah, sans the skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now, but, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now, my brother, Papyrus, Papyrus, he's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate. Yeah, go right through. I'm gonna make the bars too wide to stop anyone. Click behind that conveniently like sh shaped lamp. No way, that's hilarious. Sup, bro? You know what? S sup, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your pu recalibrated your puzzle. You just hang around outside your station. Staring at this lamp, it's really cool to you want to look. No, I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the great Papyrus, will get all the things I already deserve. Respect, recognition. I will finally be able to join the royal... People will ask to be my friend. I will bathe in a shower of kisses of... No, you won't. Maybe this lamp will help. Sans, you are not helping. Lazy bones, all you do is sit and boondoggle. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've gotten a ton of work done today. A skeleton. <laughs> but Sans, come on, you're smiling. I am, and I hate it. No. Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself. Down to the bone. Oh, I will attend to my bones. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. Okay, you can come out now. Convenient. It's so convenient. <laughs> Just convenient. It's some sort of checkpoint in the century station. But there are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. 
Oh, I guess this is not actually, hey, hate to bother you, but you can do me a favor, a favor. I've seen you, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks for doing it. I'll be up ahead. There it is. The convenience of that lamp still fills you with determination. So if you like this video, leave a like, comment down below if you want to see more, uh, Undertale, um, and subscribe if you're new and may the odds be ever in your favor. Bye.